Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am so excited because we are going to a special grocery store. Um, it's a pretty high top grocery stores in LA lately. Well, it's been a, um, it's been a few years, but um, I just think that I should just check it out. Today we are going to Erwan. I don't know how to pronounce it properly but I looked it up it's how it is it's to say it um it's Erwan Erwan I guess so what is it what is an Erwan market so it is an organic grocery stores where you can buy household supplies organic household supplies organic foods it is usually located in rich neighborhoods where people can buy it can afford it um, I know that in LA, um, we have one in Studio, Studio City, in Santa Monica. Is it gonna be worth it? I don't know, because I've never really been there. So let's go, let's go check it out. Okay, we're here and first off we have organic brass chicken at $16.99, $12.49 per pound, which is insane. I could get it much cheaper at somewhere else for non-GMO, free range, non-hormones. Next we have a dozen of egg at $10.99. It's getting crazier. A gallon of raw milk is $19.99. Next we have a jar ready to eat chicken soup full of organic ingredients at $16.99. But I'm sure if I made it at home, I could get a full, big pot of it. Extra virgin olive oil is already expensive. And this one is at $21.99. And I'm not sure why it's not all liquid. This one, we have another brand of extra virgin olive oil at $29.99. And it's the same thing. It's not all liquid. I'm not sure why. Maybe it's the good stuff. This time we have honey and most of them are surprisingly at decent price. The one I'm holding is at $15.99. Next up we have some ground nutmeg onion powder at $6.49, $5.49 at okay price. We have a tiny jar of bay leaves at $5.49. We have more ingredients for 5 bucks and above. We're on to healthy snacks aisles this time. The first one we have granola at $14.99 and as we can see we can pronounce all the ingredients which is a good sign. We have some candied walnut at 12 bucks. We have a pack of 16 ounce of almonds at 33 bucks which is insane. A pack of organic dried mango for $8.69. The organic fruits and vegetables are at decent price. And the last one we have bottled water, which are at competitive price. <laughs> okay, let's start. I'm speechless. So we're done um, looking around inside. We're, we're back. Did I buy anything? Nope. Did I ever um, thought to buy something inside before I went? I would say, yeah, maybe, I don't know, the some stuff that I need, but nope, I, I do not. So what, what, what do I think of Air One? It is expensive um, for some of the stuff. My question is, how organic is organic? Is it just the label or is it just, is it just the advertisement or is it purely organic? Is it affordable? Is it worth the money you spend on? Well, if you have the money and you're willing to spend the money, I would say yes, it's, it is affordable and it is you're rich, but 
if I have those kind of money in the future, would I buy those kind of stuff? I don't think so because um for let's say for eggs, you can buy some organic eggs um for three or four bucks cheaper at another grocery stores. You can buy some organic um organic chickens for less, like a lot less. It's and it's organic. But I don't want to say it's all negative, it's all pricey. I think um, I have some positive thoughts about it. Which is, um, when we walked in, you, we can see how, um, how clean it is. Um, how, how the crews are ready to help us if we, if we need them. I did not see any empty aisles. Um, everything was fully stocked. The price that you are paying for it's for those experience you know so I guess it's worth it for them also not all of them were expensive um, the fruits the vegetables it was it was decent it was packed I could barely move I could barely shoot um, some stuff and I was kind of afraid that my, um, some of the crews were gonna we're gonna stop me and kick me out, but they didn't. They they acknowledged me and they just they didn't do anything. What should I do for my next vlog? If you have any suggestions, leave a comment and I'll see you next time. Bye, thank you.